Columbus City Council announcing their priorities for the city's operating budget in 2023. NBC4's Jonathan Jackson now joins us live to discuss what some of those initiatives are. Jonathan? Yeah, guys, council members presented several amendments to this year's operating budget, including things such as affordable housing, safer neighborhoods, and more workforce development. This budget truly reflects our shared values as a city and as a council. Today, members of Columbus City Council gathered to announce their changes to the city's operating budget, adding $23 million in new proposals to the city's billion dollar general fund that would work to improve quality of life for residents. Uh, but what you will see from the amendments from this council is a commitment to say that this next chapter of Columbus, every resident has to share in our success story. Those amendments include improving access to affordable housing, increasing workforce development, and creating safer neighborhoods through nonviolent response units. To do a non-police uh, pilot, response pilot, uh, similar to a program that was started in Dayton about two years ago um, that sends out non-police officers to low uh, acuity um, non-violent incidences. In addition, the plan to expand affordable housing would provide tenant protections for low-income residents, a concept that was pushed for by the Columbus Urban League. Our assets in this community are all of our people, not certain neighborhoods, not certain demographics, but all of our people. Stephanie Hightower serves as the president and CEO of the Columbus Urban League and says these initiatives are critical in creating equity within Columbus. In housing, safe neighborhoods, um, uh, workforce development, we need to make sure that everybody has access to all of those priorities. Now, City Council plans to pass these amendments next Monday, and then it goes to the mayor's office for approval. Local for you in Columbus, I'm Jonathan Jackson, NBC4.